So I have managed to officially destroy the fish room. I need to catch you up on exactly what I have done the last couple of days because I have officially made a mess. But let me catch you up on exactly what the game plan is and what I have done so far. Ever since I have gotten back from all the traveling, I can say that I have officially destroyed the fish room and have accomplished making a complete mess. But I am trying so far to clean up the ceiling, all these boards up here, there's always cobwebs. I'm trying to get the walls primed the best I can before I absolutely have to move all of these tanks. Jesse is working on a new rack for me that I am super excited to finally get to see soon, but he is working on that over at his parents' house. So I'm excited. It should take the majority of this wall and then all of the tanks will be just along this back wall right here. I will give you a look, but the goal is to just have more room. We have outgrown. This space has done it's it's been really great for as long as it's lasted and I did enjoy everything the way it was but I am tired honestly of tripping over cords and we just need more room for the water changes we don't have but like a foot to get in between this desk and I will show you here in just a second in this rack there's only about a foot and it makes water changes just difficult and if you are like me if it's a little bit hard to just walk chances are I'm going to put it off as long as possible and I think that's what I have been doing lately is just putting off everything because it's going to be a lot of work but honestly at the end of the day I am excited to get finally started because once I get started and then I get excited but I will give you a look of what I've done so far and give you a last look of what everything looked like before I got started. But right now it's just, <laughs> I thought it was bad before, but now it is a complete mess down here. I did manage to move this. This was the shelf with all the food on it that I've, I've been using. All the food is in here. And I am just trying to get this wall primed the best I can again so I I just don't want to move these tanks to the floor just to have them sit in the floor for a while until the racks are over here and done so I'm just trying to get as much done on this room honestly as I can before I absolutely have to move all of these tanks right here because once the racks over here hopefully I can have everything Hopefully I can get everything painted and get as much as I can done before Jesse brings those racks over because then once we move these tanks, hopefully I can just move them onto the rack. They might have to sit there a few days without being plugged in, but there's not very many fish down here with a really high bio load and all the tanks are really planted, so I feel like a couple of days will be just fine until everything's hooked back up he's going to add a few outlets along this wall too so fingers crossed that should take just a short amount of time but i'm just going to paint my life away for the next few days probably there's a lot this wall right here is what i'm probably going to have the most work with because i can't if necessary, I could probably move these myself, but these tanks right here, I just can't move that by myself at all. So, and I don't want to break anything. So I would like to get everything done until I get to this wall right here. And then Jesse's just going to have to help me move a couple things because if I'm going to paint all of this, I might as well do this too. So I will have to say I'm going to go with a darker color but I'll probably just reprime that. I really do like the look of something lighter. It's been dark blue for so long that, I mean, I like, you can't tell, but it's a really pretty metallic silver, but I don't like it. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and prime that wall again too, and then go with something a lot lighter overall might. 
I don't necessarily want a white, but something a really light, light gray, I think would be cool. So let me know what you think down in the comments, but I'm excited to finally get this started and to see what those racks look like. He gave me a sneak peek and I'll let you see that, but I, I haven't really seen them and I don't really know. They're supposed to go along this whole wall from that corner right there to this corner right here, but we're not sure if we're gonna move this or keep it here yet. I'm not sure yet. See, I think the lighter color makes this room look a lot more open and bigger than having, I do enjoy the blue. I mean, it goes with a fish room, but now that I've painted it just with the primer, I do feel like the white looks a lot better, but I'm really indecisive. So please let me know what you think. Here is a closer look of that metallic gray. I didn't do the final top coat, which is, you're supposed to add the texture to it. I figured this wall, it's just a concrete wall. So adding textured paint would enhance the texture of the concrete, <laughs> but I just, I feel like it's too dark. We're gonna leave this the way it is. And then the floor, we're going, I found some pads like this that look like hardwood. I just, I like having the pads, but we aren't going to put them underneath the tanks again. So we'll probably just have them along here and then stop them where the stand's going to be. But I'm just trying to get again <laughs> past all of this. I can squeeze through, I can show you. I mean, this is why I want to do this because I'm just tired of squeezing through things, but that is where I've been working. But there's always these cords and that is what I'm trying to get away from. I just I hate having cords. And of course that is part of my fish room currently, but there's just enough space all the way back there to that back wall that I can, even though it's challenging, I can do this without moving these racks, but I just don't want to unplug them and leave them in the floor. So I'm just trying to keep them plugged in as, and set up as long as possible until I have to move them. So that is the goal. I'm still tripping over things, but wish me luck. <laughs> I mean, look at this. It is worse currently because I have been back here kind of shuffling things. It was honestly more organized than this, but not, not by much. But this is why I want to do this because I am t I'm just tired of this. <laughs> so... Make sure you are subscribed to the channel so you can get updates on what I can manage to do with just this ladder <laughs> and a few things. So <sighs> wish me luck again, and I will catch you in the next update soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.